So in this video, we are going to learn how to add leads from Facebook lead ads to Zoho Begin CRM. Let's say you're using Zoho Begin as a CRM platform for your business and to market your business, you are running some Facebook ads. So using this automation, whenever a new lead will be generated on your Facebook lead ads, automatically you can add that same lead and Zoho Begin as a new contact. Now, if you want to know how you can set up this kind of automation for that, you just have to come with me to my screen. So as you can see, this is my Facebook page. And on this particular Facebook page, I'm running some Facebook ads as well to generate some new leads. Now I want that all the leads which I'm getting from Facebook ads, I want to add those leads in Zoho Begin as new contact. Now to do this, we have to connect our Facebook leader account, our Facebook ads account with Zoho Begin. And we are going to use an automation and integration platform called Public Connect to do so. So here you can see we are on Public Connect's dashboard and to reach this dashboard, you will get a free sign up link of Public Connect in the description box below. After reaching to this dashboard, we have to create an automation workflow over here. So to get started, just click on create workflow button and give this workflow a name. Let's say I'll name my workflow as Facebook lead ads to Zoho begin. You can basically give any other name of your choice. Then after that, just select the folder of your Public Connect account in which you want to create this workflow and click on create. Now after clicking on create here, you can see the workflow is open over here. And in this workflow, you can see two different windows. First one is the trigger window and second one is the action window. So triggers and actions are basically those two concepts, those two principles on which this whole automation works on, where the trigger says when this happens and the action says do this. So let's get started with the trigger window. Now the idea here is, first we are going to connect our Facebook account, our Facebook page with Fably Connect in the trigger step. So that all the leads which we are getting on our Facebook page from Facebook ads, all of those leads will be received inside Public Connect and every time we get a new lead, this automation workflow will trigger. Then after that, using the same Public Connect automation, we are going to send the details of that lead to Zoho Begin. And we are going to add those leads as contact in our Zoho Begin CRM as well. So let's see how it is done. Starting from our trigger window, in Choose app, search for Facebook lead ads. Just select it. After selecting Facebook lead ads in trigger event from the dropdown, select the trigger event as new lead instant. Now after selecting the trigger event, here you can see we have to just connect our Facebook lead ads account. Click on this connect button and select this add new connection option. And to start connecting our account, just click on this connect with Facebook lead ads. Now because I have already logged into my Facebook account in my browser, Pabli Connect will detect the same account and make the connection. If you are making a new connection, it will ask us for the authorization. So you can just give the access permission and then the connection will be created. Now after making this connection, the first thing it asks us is the page. So here in this drop down, you will see a list of all the pages which I have in my Facebook account. Now out of all of this, the page on which I am running some ads in my Facebook account is named as Green Pro Landscaping. So let's say from this particular page, I'm running some Facebook lead ads and getting the new leads. And to those leads, I want to add in Zoho Begin. So from this drop down, we are going to search for that particular Facebook page. Just select it. So I've selected Green Pro Landscaping. After selecting our Facebook page, the next thing it asks us is the lead gen form. And here in this drop down, you will get a list of all the lead gen form which you have created to generate leads for this particular page. Now here in my account, I have created two forms. Now, if you want to add the new leads from a particular lead generation form in your Zoho Begin account, then from this drop down, you can select that particular form. But if you want to add the new leads from all the lead gen form which you have created for this Facebook page, you can select this all lead gen form option as well. So I want to add the leads from all the forms. So I'm selecting all lead gen forms. After selecting this, just click on this save and send test request button. And after clicking on save and send test request, here you will see it is showing us waiting for webhook response. This means Public Connect is waiting to get some response, some details of a new lead from Facebook lead ads. So what we are going to do, we are going to generate a test lead, a dummy lead over here. We are going to use the Facebook lead ad testing tool. Now using this testing tool, you can basically generate some test leads and capture those test leads over here in Public Connect as well. 
Now, if you want to learn more about Facebook lead ad testing tool, that how you can access this testing tool or how you can use this testing tool for generating test lead, we already have a dedicated video live on the channel. You can refer to that video and learn how you can use the lead ad testing tool. After reaching here, here under page from this drop down, we have to select the Facebook page that for which particular page we want to generate the test lead. Then after that, in the next field, we have to select the form. So here in this drop down, you will get a list of all the lead gen form which you have created for this Facebook page. Like right now, I've created two different forms for this particular page. So you can see both of them. Just select a form and click on this preview form button. After clicking on preview form, this form will open in front of us in preview mode. And here in this form, we are going to enter the details of a test lead, a dummy lead. So let's say the name of this person is demo test. This is the email address of this test lead which we are going to generate and this is a dummy mobile number. After entering the dummy details, just click on next and then just click on submit. And as we click on submit, we will see just now we have generated a test lead using this Facebook lead ad testing tool. And because we have connected our Facebook lead ads account with Public Connect, we will see in the struggle step of our workflow, we have received the response. And in this response, you can see the details of that exact same lead. Here you can see the same name demo test, you can see the same email, same mobile number and also some other details related to this newly generated lead. So here we have successfully completed the step one of setting up this automation and after that here you can see we have successfully received the new leads from Facebook lead ads in our Public Connect workflow. Now after this let's move to step two and in step two we want to send these same details of a new lead and we want to add these leads as contacts in Zoho Begin. For that, we will just scroll down and come to this action step. And here in Choose App, we are going to search for Zoho Begin. Just select it. After selecting Zoho Begin, here in Action Event from the drop down, select the Action Event as Create Contact. Now just click on Connect and select Add New Connection. Now here we have to connect our Zoho Begin account with Pabli Connect. And to make this connection, click on this Connect with Zoho Begin button. Then after that, here in this box, it is asking us for the domain of our Zoho account. So you might be having any one of these domain of your Zoho account. To check the domain of your Zoho account, just log into your Zoho Begin account and here in the URL section, you can see the domain. Like I have the domain as Zoho.in. So we have to enter that same domain of our Zoho account over here. And then just click on save. Now as you click on save, here this pop-up window will appear in front of us. We just have to scroll down and click on this accept button. And after clicking on accept, we will see our Zoho Begin account will get connected with Pathly Connect. And after making this connection, the first thing it asks us is the owner. So here in this drop down, you can see a list of all the users which you have added in your Zoho Begin account. And out of all of those users, all of those team members which you have added, who will be the owner of these contacts which we are creating? We have to select that. Right now, I have only one user in my Zoho Begin account that is named as Demo1348. So I'm selecting that particular user and this user will be the owner of these contacts in Zoho Begin. Then after owner, it is asking us for the first name. That what is the first name of the new contact which we are creating. So we have received the details of a new lead from Facebook lead ads and we have received the details like first name, last name, email and mobile number. And we have to basically map all of these details to this Zoho Begin action step into their respective field. And the process of mapping is very simple. Simply click on this field and here in this drop down from Facebook lead ad responses, select the response of first name and it will be mapped over here. In this way, whatever first name the user, the lead is going to enter in our lead gen form, the same details will be received inside Public Connect and with the same details, we are going to add them as contact in Zoho Begin. After first name, it is asking us for the last name. So we'll just click here and from the drop down, we are going to select the response of last name and map it over here. Then it is asking us for the date of birth, lead source. So we haven't received all of these details from our Facebook lead ads from the lead form responses. So you can basically ignore these details, ignore these fields for now. Then we have received the email address and mobile number. So by using the same process of mapping, we are going to map the email address and also we are going to map the mobile number over here. Then it is asking us phone number, company name, description, and some other details. 
and we don't have these details for these leads. So we are just going to keep this field blank. We are just going to ignore these fields for now and we will scroll down and click on save and send test request button. Now when we click on save and send test request here you can see we have received some response and this response seems to be a positive response to us. This response shows that the details of a new lead which we have mapped over here basically the new lead which we have received from Facebook lead ads the same lead with the same details is now added as a contact in Zoho Begin. So let's check it. We will go to our Zoho Begin account and we will just refresh this page once. And yes, here you can see demo test, the same person whose details we have added in just now in the lead ad testing tool, the same person is now added as a contact in Zoho Begin. Here you can see the same name, the same email address and also the same mobile number of this particular user. So in this way you can see the automation workflow which we have created using Public Connect. This automation is working perfectly fine. Now after setting up this automation, we are going to test this automation in real time. For that, we will just go to our lead ad testing tool and we are going to generate another test lead. But using this lead ad testing tool, we can only generate one lead at a time. So what we are going to do, we will click on this delete lead button. So we have just now deleted the existing lead which we have created just now. And after deleting this lead, just refresh this page once. After refreshing the page from this drop down, once again, we are going to search for our Facebook page for which we want to generate the lead. Just select the page and select the form. Click on this preview form button. And then here you can see the lead gen form is open in front of us. This time we are going to enter the details of another dummy user, a dummy test lead. So the name of the person is demo user. We are going to enter the email address. This is the email address. And we are going to enter another dummy mobile number over here. Let's click on next and click on submit. So as we click on submit here, you can see just now we have generated another test lead using Facebook lead ads. We have received a new lead in Facebook lead ads. And because we have created this automation, we will see automatically within few seconds, the same person will be added in our Zoho Begin. So let's check it. We will go to Zoho Begin and we are going to just refresh this contacts page once. And here you can see dummy user, the same person, the same lead is added in Zoho Begin as contact. And we have the lead with the same details. We have the same name, same email and same mobile number. So we have tested this automation in real time and this automation is working perfectly fine. So not just these applications, you can connect plenty of other applications with Pabli Connect. And one more important thing, you will find the clone link of this exact same workflow in the description box below. By clicking on that link, you can clone the same workflow into your own Pabli Connect account and use this automation workflow for free. Pabli Connect offers you a free plan and in this plan, you will get some free tasks every month into your own Pabli Connect account. So if you want to try and test this automation, you can do it for absolutely free. If you have any kind of doubts or queries, you can email us at support at or post it on our forum over here or you can write us in the comment box below too. If you want to check out the pricing of Pavli Connect, you can visit this link. And if this video was helpful to you, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to Pavli. So this is it for today's video. Thank you. Have a great day.